you right here with the blunt rap capo Iski. And Iski, you know, I know you're a deep thinker. We just had the video of you explaining your state of mind when shit get bad for you. So I wanted to know if you had any words of encouragement or advice or anything you would want to say to the great Joel Santana for going through what he going through right now. Could be possibly facing time with the feds. Them, them be the type of situations that be kind of leaving me a little speechless for real, for real. I'm going to be real, you know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, you know, I don't know his personal life, you know what I'm saying? And from the outside looking in, I can view it like a motherfucker could be silly to even be putting themselves in a, you know what I'm saying, that type of situation. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, so being as though that I'm a nigga that, you know, you know, I think, before I speak, ultimately, so, so I ain't even the type that's gonna be like, man, he's silly, man. Oh, you know what I'm saying? He, he get what he deserve, you know? Cause you never know at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? So, the only words of encouragement that I can have for a nigga in that position is, you know, of course, hopefully, you know, he do everything that he can do and get the right people to do what they need to do to keep him home, you know what I'm saying? So he can be with his family and, you know what I'm saying? Do what he gotta do as a man. But he gotta know, he gotta start making better decisions, you know what I'm saying? To prevent anything in that nature from happening, you know what I'm saying? Cause like I said, I don't know his personal life, but at the end of the day, the reality of it is, shit looks silly from the outside, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just being real, you a nigga, that's looked at as a legend from a nigga like me, you know what I'm saying? So, so that's that's the best I can do, you know what I'm saying? Get your shit together, you know what I'm saying? Like, great out here, you know what I'm saying? Live up to that great potential that a lot of us. That used to be what they called them, you remember? They you know used to saying? call them Jewel yeah. Santana the Great. That's what I'm getting at. So a nigga gotta live up to that, you know what I'm saying? And even before, even before Santana got locked up, over his career, he just look a little inconsistency, and I don't give a fuck about the business of it. People give away free music every day, B. You know what I mean? I don't. I feel like he been absent, and a true Dipset fan like me, I always thought that Santana was the most passionate out of all of them. Yeah, you, I felt you him the most, that passion and to me, I haven't felt that from him in a long time. I was saying it a little bit when he had to come back with the um. Remember he had the Drake sample? I feel like Joel Santana, oh, yeah, yeah, they yeah. coming out the fan. Um, and then the other video he had with that where it was showing flashbacks, I felt a little bit, it was like it was coming. You know what I mean? But so, I, I agree, you know, he gotta get his shit together. But, we always, like I tell people, you know what I'm saying? You never know what a person is going through. At the end of the day, no matter the level, the status, all this, we all human at the end of the day, so it's, it's something that somebody's going through that you may or may not relate to, you know what I'm saying? So you really not gonna have that answer to to really judge at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? Have any Bible view. But the real the real is the real. The truth is the truth, you know what I'm saying? When some shit looks silly, a nigga gotta let it be known, you know what I'm saying? And a lot of shit be looking silly with a lot of these situations, you know what I'm saying? A motherfucker should be putting themselves in the type of situation where they ain't even the blog that ain't what the blogs is talking about you know what i'm saying you know they they geeking for that type of shit they love to catch a nigga slipping you know what i'm saying so yeah man that's basically it right basically all right <laughs>